Star and welcome to my channel. Starlight Star Rate 70. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new, welcome. Come on in. So today it's Mother's Day. So happy Mother's Day to all you beautiful ladies out there. Um, to all my beautiful subscribers. And even if you're watching, you're not subscribed. And if you're a mom, happy Mother's Day. Whether it be children or fur babies, uh, you are still a mom. And today I just wanted to shout out a channel. I am working on this little girl with the, uh, the little praying girl with her little puppy here. So I'm working on that one this morning. Uh, but I want to do my shout out for today for Mother's Day. Um, her channel's name is Connie's Little Corner. She is in Arizona. And she does uh, Timu hauls with her um, with her mom. Uh, her mom is, I think she just celebrated her 90, 92nd birthday, I think. Sorry if I got that wrong. But yeah, they, she just had a birthday and so she is in her 90s anyway. And uh, how incredible is that? And so every Sunday they do little Timu hauls together. And it's just a blessing to watch them. I know that if my mom was still alive, and yes, happy Mother's Day to my mom, even though she's not here. My mother taught me a lot growing up, and I loved her very much. And she's always um, missed. I miss her very much. And I do know that if she were still alive today, she would definitely want to be involved <laughs> in my uh, in my hauls that I do. She was just that type of lady. Very helpful, very friendly. Um, she was just a wonderful mom. So yeah, so I just want to anyway shout out for uh, Connie's little corner there. Um, if you don't know who she is, go check her out. She'll probably have a video up today with her and her mom on Mother's Day. And uh, they are just a blessing to watch. I just absolutely love watching uh, watching their channel or watching her videos. So I have uh, watched her for actually quite a while now. Um, hmm, it's been quite, uh, probably quite a few months. Anyways, if there's anything that you ever want to know about tips and tricks regarding uh, Timu, uh, she, she'll she let you know. Um, she has actually quite a few videos out there with tips about Timu, so quite interesting, everything that she's researched. Um, but yeah, so please go check them out, show them some love. Today is Mother's Day, and like I said, she'll probably have her mom on today. Uh, but I just, she's very down to earth. Um, yeah, so I just, and she explains all the products really well too. So if that's something you like to be explained, just make sure I'm doing the right color here, yeah. Um, then you'll really love her channel. Because, yeah, she really explains things quite thoroughly. But. So, uh, Connie out there, I, I don't know if you watch me or not, but um, I just wish you a very happy Mother's Day and your mom as well. And what a blessing to live that old, to be in your 90s and still be alive. So. Imagine what she's seen in her years. <laughs> you know, just uh, really incredible. So yeah, so that's my shout out for today. I will put her um, up on my screen here as well as in my description. So she will be in my uh, description there. Just click on uh, her channel. It will be my shout outs and then under there will be her channel. So just click on her name there and it will take you right to her channel and then, yeah, go show her some love. That would be so wonderful if you would do that. Other than that, like I said, I just wish all you mothers out there a wonderful day. 
Um, me, I'll probably be talking to my kids later on today. And I also have two daughters that are moms. And so, of course, we'll be wishing them a happy Mother's Day. And wish we lived closer so we could all celebrate together. But we are a thousand miles apart right now. <laughs> and, uh, but there's always, um, there's always FaceTime, which I absolutely love to be able to spend time with my kids on uh, the FaceTime when we can. And, and I understand they're busy. They... They are working and stuff, but uh, I did have a really good time, face time with them. Uh, two of my daughters, not that long ago, and my grandson. Yeah, it was really nice to spend time with them. Just love it. Other than that, I don't think I have, oh, my husband's going to make a really nice meal for us tonight. He's going to have ribs and... Uh, Probably mashed potatoes, I'm not sure. Uh, salad, and I'm not sure what else he's got planned. I just, I do know the ribs, though, because he showed me. Look what I picked up for you for Mother's Day. I love ribs. Ribs or steak? Those are my two favorites. But this time he picked up some ribs, so that's what we'll be having tonight. In celebration for Mother's Day. And he usually always gets me flowers, but he said the flowers this time kind of looked ill, so he didn't get any. <laughs> he said they, uh, he said they were all wilting and they didn't look nice. So I still do have some flowers left over from my anniversary. My carnations are still uh, not quite um, dead yet, so I told him that was good enough. So. It's funny because my uh, dad used to buy my mom flowers all the time. Now my husband buys me flowers all the time. So, <laughs> so nice. So what do you guys got planned today? Let me know. Are you like going out? Are you celebrating with your families, with your kids? If you're a fur baby mama... Uh, I'm a fur baby mama as well. I got my two little puppies and they're still sleeping. And then I've also got three cats and they are probably going to be coming around here shortly wanting food. Because usually by 8 o'clock in the morning they're begging for food. But we'll see if they come around or not. <laughs> Everything's still quiet in the household. Even the birds aren't quite singing yet. They're usually, I hear the birds in the morning. And I don't hear them. I probably need to have. Probably need to put out more bird seed. But I mean, the sun is just coming up. It's probably not even. I don't even know what time it is. Probably around seven thirty. And uh, so yeah. So I'll probably go outside and I will feed the birds and I will enjoy the sun coming up. I really enjoy that time in the mornings. And before it gets like way too hot, we're getting into the high 80s here now. So during the day, of course, you have to have the air conditioner running and it sounds like a, I don't know what, but it gets really loud. And... Then I usually have my fan going, cause just to get the air movement around in the in here, and that can get annoying. <laughs> All these noises, and then I have my my tinnitus I deal with with my ringing in my ears. So yeah, it's quite something. Some days, let me tell ya. But feeling a lot better now, though. So did anyone get out to see the um? Aurora Borealis. Ooh, I got the name right. See, it's a new day. <laughs> um, we can't see them here, unfortunately. But I saw some gorgeous pictures for people that have seen them. 
So the one thing I don't like about this tray, this is the one I got from Monday Savings, is that I noticed that the drills get stuck in these grooves. Um, but this is the painting I'm working on. It's like I said, it's a little girl here. And she's praying. So I'm working on her outfit here. Here's her little puppy dog here. So she's she's gonna look absolutely amazing, I think, when she's done. And I just absolutely love this this painting. It's only a 30 by 30. So I should have it done. If I had worked on it uh, today, I'd probably have it done by pretty much by this evening if that's if this is the only painting I work on today. But we'll see how that goes. I do also want to start sorting out um, some of my diamond paintings I have. Uh, we've got a really nice dresser uh, we picked up from, from Timu for uh, quite a good price. And so uh, I want to start getting them all organized, put them in the right places. My What I want to do is, is put my put in each drawer so my husband's well my husband and I were talking and this is what we suggested together so it was a together <laughs> decision as you can say um that's funny that this is kind of a blue color for the ears but anyway um so he wants to take all the paintings and he wants to coordinate them into uh, whether they be like animals or like my little girls of course my Disney and then my uh, religious paintings so I guess that's how we're going to coordinate it um, he wants to do a, a whole spreadsheet <laughs> and uh, then we will know exactly which drawer the drills are in when it comes to me wanting to work on a painting otherwise we're like searching through all my containers here and it can take like an hour before we actually find the drills to which painting but uh, I do have containers and they are they are a bit more organized I also use the gem gem flow I think it's the gem flow app uh, that you can download on your phone and on there there's a place where you could put notes and in those notes I have which bin uh, my my drills are in so for that painting so I mean no it doesn't take that long I was over exaggerating <laughs> but he feels it takes that long <laughs> it goes to uh, when he tries to help me uh, find some drills to a painting I want to work on it's quite funny then I want to get my smaller paintings into my portfolio books that I have uh, and get those all organized and so those are just some of the little projects I'm going to be working on in the upcoming weeks so when we don't have a haul to do I think we'll be doing that I have uh, someone has requested if I could do a uh, do it yourself once a month <laughs> it's like hmm sure I could do that whether it be working on my little keychains I got or uh, putting a painting to canvas or something I'm sure I could come up with something so we do be planning that out I do have some upcoming uh, Timu hauls we're going to be doing and I have a mystery swap with somebody, so I got I received my package, so now I'm just waiting for her to re to receive hers. And then we can do that, and then what else? Oh, and then I got a couple PR packages coming yet, so we should be busy till the end of the month, which is uh, which is great. But if not, then I have lots of paintings I'm working on, so you can always do a whip and chat. 
Um, I absolutely love visiting with you guys and just being able to talk about anything. <laughs> it doesn't happen very often. Uh, it's just when we're doing hauls or something like that. So this is really, really nice. So yeah, guys, let me know. What are your plans for today? I would love to hear uh, what your day is going to look like. And of course, if you know you don't watch this till later or whatever, if you just come across this, yeah, if you're new, welcome. Um, I do mostly diamond painting, but I do a lot of Timu hauls. Um, I also have done other places as well. Uh, yesterday I did a uh, Dollar Tree haul. That was a lot of fun. And I uh, got a couple things from a yard sale. So, so yeah, we do. I do a little bit of everything here, and uh, absolutely have an awesome RV. I call it my RV family because that's what you guys are. Um, I am in an RV, and I love it. I love it out here, and I live in New Mexico currently, and I absolutely love it out here. Except for the winds, sometimes get pretty strong. <laughs> the desert winds I guess but other than that it's uh I love it out here oh, excuse me didn't mean to yawn like that sorry for all the ones out there yawning now because <laughs> I know how that's contagious oh I got my little lens my little uh tea light here going this is something I picked up yesterday at my yard sale I just love it it's so so cute but anyways, guys, so yeah, so I just wanted to come on here. Wish everybody a happy Mother's Day uh, again. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Please consider subscribing. You can go check out my other videos. Uh, please give me a like. <laughs> or what do they say? A thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up. And uh, I would love to... Uh, Read your comments today on what your day, uh, what you what you got planned for the day, or what you did today. That would be awesome. Uh, so, I know it's only been probably what twenty minutes, maybe, since uh, we started this, but that's all right. Uh, I need to do. I'm gonna do one more color here. I can find it. So this is the tray that I got from AliExpress. And because this only has 18 colors, I didn't bother putting uh, the symbols on these bags. And like I said, this painting did come from One Day Savings. It was came from a PR package. And so I will be putting One Day Savings... Um, taking their or putting their website or putting their website in my description for you guys and I can also link this painting for you um, it might not be up right away depending I might have this video up before my husband gets out of bed <laughs> he does the YouTube uh, descriptions and stuff for me I can put it to YouTube no problem but when it comes to um, and putting all that description and stuff I find it very hard to do on my phone, and he does it on the computer, and so, um, yeah, he just, he can just, uh, copy and paste to whatever he does, and goes really fast, but for me, when I'm inputting, it takes me forever to input that stuff, uh, on there, but I do my own, my own little editing on the videos itself. I make all the little characters and stuff like that. Or stickers, I guess they're called. Little GIFs. <laughs> I like doing that on my videos. So you will see those. But, but anyway, so. Just doing the U's. I couldn't believe how many lemonade stands are out there yesterday. It was honest to God, every time we turned a corner, there was a lemonade stand. Um, there must have been, I personally probably saw at least 20 of them 
just uh, around town as we were driving around. So I don't know how many more there were, but all these kids trying to sell lemonade yesterday. <laughs> Read something. And I didn't even know there was a National Lemonade Day. I'm like, what? I said, yeah, National Lemonade Day. So I'm going to have to look more, look, look up more about it. Because like I said, I, it's the first time I've heard of, heard of it. So I didn't even heard of, hear of it last year. I don't think Canada has that, but maybe now they do. I'm not sure. It's something that either I didn't pay attention to or just didn't know about. There we go. Now I can hear my birds. My birdies are back. <laughs> Probably wanting to be fed. So I think I am going to go make a coffee. I'm going to finish these U's here first. Then I'm going to make a coffee. And then I'm going to go feed my birds. And then I'm going to uh, settle down. Or settle in I should say. And watch. Um, there's a, a church service that I watch every Sunday. On YouTube. Cornerstone Church. And there's two services actually. One I think starts at 7.30 and then one that starts at 11, I believe. So he does two services, him and his son. Uh, so yeah, I try, to, I try to watch that every Sunday. So I haven't found a church here yet in... Uh, not that there isn't any churches, but... Um, we can't leave our dogs in the trailer alone. Uh, we can leave the cats, but yeah, we can't leave the dogs. So, unfortunately, um, I don't think it's a good idea to bring our puppies into church with us. <laughs> so, it's just, uh, and it's so much easier just to, you know, uh, watch a service on TV. At least for me. But, I mean, there's times that I miss the, um, the fellowship of the church, right? You have, uh, your church family, but that's okay. I have all, of, I have all my RV family, <laughs> which is wonderful. Absolutely love my RV family. And if you're not part of the RV family, yeah, consider doing so. Make sure you uh, hit that subscribe button. It's free. We'd love to have you here. But anyway, as I finish up my use here, I'm going to say, from my home to yours, I hope you have a most wonderful day. If uh, you do celebrate Mother's Day. I uh, wish you a very happy one. And even if you don't celebrate Mother's Day, and if you are a woman, <laughs> regardless whether or not you have kids or not, whether it be uh, any kind of kids, even your even your little uh, furry animals, um, you are a mom. So. So yeah, so thank you to all the moms out there for all the hard work and everything you do. Uh, it's not easy being a mom. <laughs> uh, the struggles sometimes are real. Um, it can be very frustrating. But the reward at the end is uh, just a blessing. And So yes, so, so with that... I will um, say in closing, as I always say, <laughs> oh, God's richest blessings. And uh, again, have a most wonderful day.